up, y'all? This your boy Ace here, and welcome to After News to like, Let's get into this, because this is actually very interesting to me. Um, so, Damage Control came out for a second time tonight. Um, Dakota Kai was going to come out anyways, because she was getting ready to have her match with um, Lyra Valkyria uh, for the Queen of the Ring tournament, which she ended up losing to Lyra, and Lyra's first main event, um, uh, main roster match on Raw tonight, her Raw debut. And uh, like I said, Becky Lynch, I already did a video of when Becky Lynch was talking to Liv and Liv was talking about wanting respect for him. And then she also reassured everyone that she is here to take everything away from Rhea. So I talked about that in the last video as well. So Damage Control comes out and they actually call out Liv because they they felt like Liv shouldn't have this. Uh, well, at least Dakota Kai felt like Liv shouldn't have this uh, opportunity to come after the title first from Becky because it sounds like Dakota Kai or anyone from Damage Control to come after the title. So, Eo Sky won her match earlier tonight. She beat Natalia. And Nicola Kai says she's coming at, you know, they're coming at the Becky Lynch, but they're also coming at the Bianca Bella and Jay Cargill still. So, that was earlier tonight. Now they come out and they start surrounding the ring. Uh, also, real quick, happy birthday to Dakota Kai. She turned 36. She's my age. She's my age. I'm 36 as well, man. I'll be turning 36, 37 later this year, though. But uh, she just turned 36, so happy birthday to her. And it was on today. It was on today on May the 6th. So happy birthday to Dakota Cat. But, yeah, they started surrounding the ring. And it looked like Becky was going to have Liv. I might actually want to do another video about the Liv portion of this. Liv slips out of the ring. So it's basically a three on one now against Becky. So they start swarming Becky again like they did last week. Except that they don't have Oscar with her because Oscar's like, oh yeah, that's what I meant to bring up. Oscar has an injury right now, so we don't know when she's coming back. Um so it's just three of them. And I had an idea in that video. If y'all watched the video that I talked about earlier with Damage Control, I talked about how they can maybe fit Oscar, I mean not Oscar, Kiana James maybe to be in that group. Because I think they're more intimidating as a foursome than a threesome. You know, that's just my opinion, but y'all can let me know in the comments. So, anyways, they surround the ring, and uh, they start to get the attack in Becky Lynch, and then Lyra Valkyria comes out to save him. And Lyra was like, why do you protect, you know, Becky? You know what I'm saying? And this is where Liv is ever so closely uh, leaning towards being a heel. She is very leaning closely to being a heel because that's a heel tactic, not helping another baby face. Um, and leaving the ring like she did. So that was very interesting there. So Lyra Valkyrie got the wiping them out and they got ready for uh, her match against Dakota Cat, which, like I said earlier, she ended up winning. So Damage Control, they're very interested on Raw right now. They're very interested, especially with Judgment Day, the way they are right now. It's good to have like a little faction like that going right now where, you know, um, we're trying to figure things out. So. Pretty interesting stuff, though, man. Give me y'all thoughts on this. Let's talk about Liv Morgan. Then we're going to end the week on here on Raw, man. Go ahead and get this video a like, share, subscribe. Thank y'all for watching. After news tonight.